guys, how are you today? We're good. We're good. Okay, are you feeling excited about this video or are you a little bit scared? I'm nervous. Nervous? I don't know what we're doing. Okay, so the whole point of the video is I'll be asking you guys questions about your relationship and you will have to answer. So when I ask someone, the next partner has to have the headphones on, okay? Okay, you going first? I'm terrified. No, he's going first. Oh yeah, okay. Okay. So I just put my headphones on? Yes. Now? Okay, so what was your first impression of her? Well, I thought she was bougie. One, because the time when I met her, she didn't seem very interested. One, um, she seemed like she knew it all. She seemed like she was on top of the world, and I didn't like a girl that's really not, you know, humble. So, definitely, yeah, I thought she was bougie. Okay. Okay. Find, find the song first. Yeah, because you... Doesn't, any song is fine, doesn't really matter, because it's about to be like one second, so... Okay, so what was your first impression of him? My first impression was that he was really cute. He was a, we were at a party or a mm -hmm. pop-up shop and he was the only person I caught, like that caught my eye. Which so I thought he was really cute, he was very chocolatey, very tall, very handsome, beard gang. I was like, oh, okay. Okay, <laughs> no problem, tap him. Okay. Okay, so how was your first kiss? Your impression? How did you feel? Our first kiss? Yeah. It was it was good. Are you sure it was good? <laughs> no, no, it was good. But I'm trying to say like our first kiss. No, I remember our first. Yes, it was it was beautiful actually. Like I loved it. I loved it. Did oh. you feel butterflies or anything? Butterflies. What the, what the, <laughs> First kiss. No, it was just a very, very good kiss. Like she knew exactly what she was doing, and I knew exactly. Like it just matched so well. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 What was your first? How was your first kiss? How did you feel? Our first kiss. Um. How did I feel? I feel like I was just overall happy that I had found somebody that was like everything I wanted on paper. Mm -hmm. So like it was like a magical moment. Not to sound cliche, but like it was just very mm -hmm. like calm and magical and peaceful. Did you feel any butterflies? Oh, I still have butterflies to today, so <laughs> I definitely felt butterflies. Okay, tap, tap him. I need to change the song. It doesn't matter, it's okay. You ready? Okay. Who liked who more? Who likes who more? Who likes who more? Mm -hmm. I think it's pretty even, but she does happen to show a lot more like affection. Like when it comes to like always cuddling with me, always hugging me and stuff like that. But I'm more of the goofy type. Like I like to make sure she laughs and everything like that. But overall, I think it's pretty even. I think it's pretty even. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Who likes who more? Who likes who more? Mm -hmm. I don't know. <laughs> Why you don't know? Like, do you feel like he likes you like more? Or like more? I think we're very, it's a very equal like relationship. Like, I don't, I don't think he likes me more than I like him. I don't think I like him more than he likes me. Okay. I think we like each other a lot, very much. <laughs> who said I love you first? She did. She said that. In the first, maybe, I'm not sure the time frame, but she definitely said that I feel like this is a, a very, very deep connection, and she literally said, I think I love you. No, I know I love you, and I said, wow, like, I had to think about it for a second, but I believe that I loved her too. She means a lot to me, and I don't really want to spend any Okay. I don't want to spend any You don't gotta mute. I think I could just read this song. Okay, go ahead. Who said I love you first? I did. Why did you feel like you loved him? I, when I felt like I loved him because I loved him. <laughs> it was just a feeling like I was like, yeah, I love this boy. Like I really liked him. I was willing to sacrifice a lot for him, especially at the time, because a lot was going on in my life and. I was willing to let go of a lot for him. So I was like, yeah, I must love this boy. Cut! <laughs> cut! 
<laughs> okay, tap him. For this time, beating the. Okay, what would your life be if you? What would you? <laughs> what would your life be if you didn't meet her? Uninteresting. She brings excitement to my life. She brings new things, things I would never have thought about in a regular relationship. Okay, so but how how would your life be? Would you be broke? Would you have more money? Would I you would be lonely? definitely have more money. You know, people, you women in love to, you know. Excuse money. me. Women love to spend money, but overall, I wouldn't trade that for anything. Like I, it still wouldn't matter. Like I, I'd still have my money. Yes. Probably still have a car. Actually, to be honest, financially, I would just be up there. I would really be up there. But overall, it's like you have to make sacrifices for the ones you love. Okay. And she's definitely a sacrifice I'm willing to make. Okay, tap her. What would be your life without Timmy? My life without Timmy? Well, I'd be working. I would be in a whole completely different career. Like, I'd be in the music industry still, doing stuff like that. Um, I think that's pretty much the only thing that would have changed, like my career and just my sanity. <laughs> like, I was really like turning into a heartless bitch without her. Can I curse? I was turning into a heartless bitch in a way like I didn't really have feelings, I didn't really care about anybody but myself. Like I wanted to get to the bag by myself on myself. But then I met him and I was like, okay, I want a life that's actually like filled with happiness than just like money and you know, all that type of shit. Like that's important too, but like you still want to be happy. You still want to find that person that's gonna like you can spend the rest of your life with. Okay. So he be so into the music like he didn't want to give you the headphones. <laughs> I said you be so into the music you didn't. Nah, want to that should go hard. Okay, so why are you still in love? Why am I still in love? Yes. She brings new excitement to me every day. When I look into her eyes, I see my future. I see my life being great, and I see our future kids, and us being a happy, loving family. Okay, tap him. Oh, it's on commercial. <laughs> Hey guys, we're almost there. We only have like 30 more questions. I'm blank. I'm almost done. That's right. Okay, so why are you still in love? Why are we still in love? Um, cause I feel like cause it's a healthy relationship. We care about each other's feelings. We put each other first and everything. Like it's work. And I feel like when when you're willing to do the work for someone and you're willing to like put in effort in your relationship, you're not gonna fall out of, out of love. Like you make memories together, you know? Memories and putting in work, you're gonna have like a long lasting, you know, relationship filled with love. There's no toxic vibe between us. Everything's just good, so yeah. Stop here. Okay, so how long have you been together? And what makes you guys stay together? Three months. Three months? Yeah. Three? You have been together for three months? Yeah. Okay, tap her. Tap We've been together for three months, but we've known each other since March. Okay, so tap her. Okay, so my question is, been together and don't lie to me. Don't lie to me. How long have you been together? For nine months. Nine months? She said nine months. Nine. Now who's lying over here? You know what? That's it. Bitch. You're gonna find out what the fuck you said. <laughs> Please stop him. <laughs> no, don't tell her. I know. Can you guys please not say to each other until yeah. the video, please? You said not. Nobody do what? Okay. Would you marry her? Yes, in a heartbeat. Okay, so what is her insecurity? Her insecurity? Mm -hmm. Would you marry him? Hell yeah. Damn. <laughs> okay, what is his insecurity? Insecurity? Mm -hmm. Um, His insecurities. 
Where do I start? <laughs> I'm joking. Oh, uh, babe, is music playing? Insecurity. Um, he. I feel like he's learning how to get away from it, but because of the way he was raised and family life and school life, he has a lot of insecurities about his appearance, which I don't understand because he's a fine boy. <laughs> like, but he has a lot of insecurity about his appearance, his knowledge level or smartness level or everything because he's always comparing himself to like people who are smarter but it's like you're very intelligent yourself so yeah those are his insecurities okay tap him your biggest fight our biggest fight yeah we don't have fights no more fights okay what is your pet peeve about her a pet peeve i don't think i have a pet peeve about her or what's something that you don't like Something that you disagree that she does. There's nothing. All right, She's change. Be perfect top. in my eyes. I said, I said top her. <laughs> <laughs> That's me as a director. Is it recording still? Yeah, it's recording. Mm -hmm. So, what is your, what was your biggest fight? Our biggest fight? Okay, so what was your pet peeve? My pet peeve? Like, what is your pet peeve about him? Something that um, you disagree, something that you like, um, he needs to work on it. Um, he be loud as hell sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> he be loud as hell. His voice is very loud, but that, like I said, he comes from a family of Yoruba people, and they're very loud, so he be on the phone loud. He be like, just loud. I'm like, damn, babe, calm down. Like, okay. But yeah, he's very, he's very loud. That's a pet peeve of mine, sometimes. Okay, talk to him. Okay, what do you find attractive about her? There's no, everything is just perfect about her. I love looking at her, I love knowing that. Hey, cut! <laughs> Can I be too romantic? What? My viewers are gangsters. Okay. I'm playing, I'm playing, go ahead. Well, everything about her is beautiful from her face, her eyes, her little smile when I look at her. Like, she can't help but. It's just everything about her is just so beautiful. Her little body, look at her, look at her dance. Look at her dance. Look at her. She's so cute. Yeah, I love everything about her. <laughs> Over you! <laughs> Wait, let's go and talk about something here. What do you find attractive about him? Oh my god, don't say this way. Why it feels like to try to record when you have workers that's supposed to get their job done before you move in? <laughs> Seems like what happens. I think I can answer it. Okay. Okay. So, what do you find attractive about him? You gotta be loud then. Everything. Like I tell him all the time. Like he is like a meal to me. Like mm. a good home cooked meal. Like I find everything attractive about him. Yeah, I just find him attractive. Period. <laughs> like, okay, but I but I would say he's a very caring person. Like he has a really so you good find heart. that attractive. So his heart is very attractive. Yes. Okay, so have he ever made you cry? Like happy cry, sad? Cry? Yes, he made me cry on our um. Well, the day he asked me out officially, officially. <laughs> even though we had been together for a while, but the day he officially asked me out, the music called me. Good night, Slick. He didn't tell her. Okay. Yeah, the day he officially asked me out, he got he wrote me like a he brought like a mason jar filled with fifty reasons why he loves me, and everything was just handwritten and cute. And he bought me like it, it was just a lot. He did a lot, so I was I was like, okay. He really loves me. Oh my god. Okay, now this is the end of the question. Okay. How do you feel about him? Say something. Say something that you have not told him before. Something I haven't told him before. Like, how do you that feel about him? He, I don't, why haven't I told him? Well, I feel like he's meant for something great. Like, something bigger than himself. Like, he is such a gift to this world, like, in a way that I can't even explain. I've never met anybody who can 
like vibe with people and just make people feel so comfortable around him and he's very caring and he, random people like even at work random ass people like even old women young women children latino whatever race whatever gender whatever age like they always fuck with him like they always vibe with him and then like because of that he has a lot of connections and people always want to help him and i feel like that's someone who is set for something great in life you know he has a mission that's bigger he has a calling like a calling from god that's bigger than who he is and yeah i feel like he needs to okay. tap into that tap him Shut the fuck up, huh? I'm sorry, guys. Cheers. Figaro. Okay. Have Have she ever made you cry emotionally or like happy? Anything? Have she ever made you cry? No. No, she never made you cry? No. Okay, how do you feel about her? Like, say something that you haven't tell her. Like, overall, how do you feel about her? Overall, how do I feel about her? Yes. Um, oh, shit. I basically told her everything I need to tell her. There obviously would be more things to say in the future when time comes, but overall, there's not anything I can say that I haven't told her yet. I love her so much, and I would not be anywhere on this earth without her being my lifelong partner. Okay, thank you. Please take out the fucking hands. That's the music. That, it, it's over. That thing is oh. over. Huh? It's over. Right. <laughs> okay, so how do you feel about the experience? I liked it. Hey, you like it? Interesting. Be honest. Like be, be honest. No, I don't, like that. I like this don't idea. Like me. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared for what she said about me. No, actually, are you guys scared to see the video? I'm, I'm excited to see the video. I'm, I'm not scared. I'm excited. I'm terrified. I'm terrified. Actually, I feel like she should be more scared. You think I should be? Get more the fuck off my camera, bitch. <laughs> you think she should be more? You think she should be more scared about my answers? I mean, you guys, I will have to edit this. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah, of course, yeah, that's it. So yeah, but okay. Which couple do you guys nominate to do me? To do next? Who's a couple? You know a couple? <laughs> I was gonna say, wait, somebody you know as well? Or just anybody? Bitch, that's your business. <laughs> Don't take me. <laughs> you you <laughs> mean, <laughs> Try Shaq and Imani. Who? Shaq and Imani. Shaq and Imani? Okay, that's you guys. Mm -hmm. Okay, oh, I feel like the clock. <laughs> and cut. Do you know how long I've been wanting to do this video? Wait, why should she be scared about my answers? I don't know. Wow.